everybody. Welcome to another evening with Sips. Tonight, we're taking a look at Software Inc. Uh, apparently, this game is a lot like Game Dev Tycoon. If you remember watching me play that uh, way back when, Game Dev Tycoon. It was a great game. I really enjoyed playing it. I'm looking forward to trying this as well. Apparently, this is like kind of like a mix of The Sims and Game Dev Tycoon. You have to like build like a office for your dudes to work on software. Uh, but you have to like get all of the feng shui right so like you have to like put a water fountain in the right place so that they become more creative and stuff like that apparently I might be wrong I mean I've never played the game uh, before in my life this is the first time I've even loaded it uh, so let's check it out we'll see what it's like software Inc new game oh company name here uh, God Looking. All right. Customization tutorial. Okay. Press continue to advance the tutorial. Okay. Fine. Continue. Begin by picking a name for your company. All right. Well, uh, Sipsco Software. Software Inc. No. Sipsco. Sipsco Soft. <laughs> Sipsco so soft. <laughs> Sipsco so soft. <laughs> okay. Great. Sips go so soft it is. Uh, we have to pick a name. We've done it. Pick a name for the founder. Okay. Uh, what's this guy's name going to be? Ronnie. Uh, Johnny. Johnny. Ronnie Johnny. Uh, Ron Johnson's like son. Ronnie Johnny. Uh, of course, a male. Uh, do we need to like customize the hair? Yeah. Let's have like this. No. Oh. Oh yeah, okay, Ronnie Johnny's got that hair. Uh, what about face? We can change the color of Ronnie Johnny's... Okay, perfect. Great. Uh, what kind of hair color do we want? Uh, I think we can pretty much cancel. Are you sure you want to cancel the tutorial? Yeah. We don't need a tutorial. We know exactly what we're doing. Alright, fine. Ronnie Johnny's... Whoops. <laughs> Ronnie Johnny's skin color. Perfect. And of course, Ronnie Johnny's hair color. Hair? There, there. Aha. Yes. Okay, perfect. Golden locks on Ron Johnny. Do we want to have shorts or pants? They're like pedal pushers. They're more like pedal push. We'll go for pants. All right, fine. Let's give him a nice pair of blue jeans. Because Ron and Johnny likes to wear them. And a shirt. Oh, a t-shirt? A long sleeve shirt? I think it's got to be a t-shirt. Okay. Let's give him a nice white t-shirt that he can wear as well. Okay, perfect. Ronnie Johnny is like pretty much ready to go. We can pick his personality as well. Uh, let's make him flirtatious and also um, a stubborn flirt. All right, fine. Ronnie Johnny is like the lead programmer of uh, Sips Go So Soft. He is a stubborn, flirtatious man. Uh, and I think we're like ready to go. God, look at that. He's like learned how to do the goose stepping. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Uh, Ronnie Johnny is, of course, uh, part of like um, the army as well. He's going to write some software for the army using his weird goose stepping uh, and his uh, hot style in uh, shirts and pants and shoes and also uh, hair as well. Start the game. Fine. Would you like to begin the welcome tutorial? Uh, no. Never. We don't need a tutorial. We're fine. Okay. How do we do stuff? All right. It looks like we're on a street. Uh, in the middle of nowhere, and we might actually need to build a house. Holy shit, look at this, this is pretty sweet actually. Okay, how do we start working on stuff? What are all these options? Develop software, your releases, contract work, and servers. Okay, no problem. We got HR, finance, market, toggle walls, data overlay, toggle lamps, room labels, wire mode. Alright, and how do I build stuff? Insurance policies, stocks, and loans. All software, all companies, the software times, distribution channels, deals, and upcoming releases. Great. And then I guess this is build mode. Would you like to begin the build mode tutorial? No. <laughs> I just want to build stuff. I like to just get in and get messy. All right, fine. Uh, do we need a floor? Looks like we don't. I think we just need some walls. We just want to construct a room. Okay, so this is like the Sims, right? This is the plot that we have. Uh, your rooms have to be at least two by two. 
Let's start with something small. There we go. We spent 2,880 big ones on a room. All right, we're going to need a door. Uh, let's have a standard door that leads into the... Whoa, look at this. It's like a whole menu here. Room colors, room patterns, select some furniture. All right, what kind of furniture do we need in our room? We're going to definitely need a chair, an office chair. We're going to need a desk and a computer. Where are the desks? All right, let's see. Down here, office. Okay, so it looks like there are uh, bookshelves, computers and stuff. A modern computer. This item unlocks in the year 1990. Wait a second, what year is it now? This is an old computer. Okay, an old computer uh, and the space is... Uh, it has to be on an... You have to play this, this on an occupied table. So, God, I'm like totally tripping over my words here for some reason. All right, fine. Let's get a table, a chair, and a computer set up. All right, we've got a table in the corner here. Ronnie Johnny is going to make history. We're going to put an old computer on here. How do we, like, rotate it around? That is not the way to do it. It's got to be, like, something like this. Is it the... No, is it... How, click and drag to rotate. It was saying right there how to do it. Okay, old computer, perfect. Now, do we want a cheap chair? Yes, we do. Okay, a cheap chair for Ronnie Johnny to work at. Uh, fine, we're gonna need some windows, at least a window, right? Let's just get a small window here. There, so natural light can come into the office now. Uh, we don't need an elevator, but it's interesting to note that there are actually elevators in this game. Holy crap, that means that you could have quite the, man. It, this is the best games like this are the best where you have to like manage an office or something holy crap like sign me up every time look we can even make roads we can make our own google we can make it like the, we can make a google plex we can call it the sips go so soft plex oh jeez that is really getting my um creative juices flowing okay for now let's stick to what we know and what we have we've got walls we got a door we got a window we got Ronnie Johnny's computer, it's on a table, it's ready to go. Do we need like power or anything? I don't think so. Uh, we furnished, do we want to have like some nice stuff in here so that Ronnie Johnny can look, a, look at a radiator? Could be useful, right? You have to place this right up against the wall. Okay, I mean there's some wall right here. Ah, oh, here we go. Okay, we now have a radiator so it can stay. The temperature will vary a lot in this room. Add more radiators and ventilation. Okay, we're going to need a little bit of ventilation as well. There we go. So now we have some ventilation and a radiator uh, to help us through the winter and the summer months, right? Now, do we want to do anything else here? Like, do we want to get like a couch or like a chair? There's a couch here. Uh, there's a lamp. No, oh, maybe a desk lamp? Or a wall, whoa. Or a wall lamp. <laughs> okay, maybe we want a wall lamp. Okay, and we have to like, Okay, perfect. There, all right. Ronnie Johnny's got a wall lamp, so that if he wants to work at night, he can. Uh, okay, fine. Roads and paths. Okay, we got a road here. We got some parking. Oh, I wonder if we need, a, like, a parking lot out here. Do you think we need one? Build a road. Do we want to build a road? I don't think we can build a road here. Oh, we can build a road here, though. What about this horizontal parking? Parking, parking, and parking. Okay, so look, we can have a parking spot here. Oh man, this can be so good. Okay, so if we have a road that leads from... Oh, hang on a second. How do we like... How do I... Oh! No! No, 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 no! How do I delete that? I don't want that there! Okay, I really don't want that there. Can I like delete it? Or like press Z? Or control Z? No, none of that works. All right. There's got to be a way to, like, remove road. Oh, there we go. Okay, I figured it out. Parking. We want to have, like, some parking, like, maybe here. Now, what does it say? This parking spot cannot be reached. Make sure it is connected to the main road. Okay, and then we have to have road that comes from here up to here. What the hell? Why can't we build it on this little bit here? What's, what's going on? Where's the fucking road? Get rid of this road and this parking lot as well. Okay, nobody's allowed to drive to work. Everybody has to walk to work. Because apparently this is the only plot of land we have and it's not suitable uh, for roads anyway. Well, look, we're right by the sea and everything though. I mean, Ronnie Johnny's just gonna come in here and work on his own, right? Okay. All right, click here when you are ready for your first day. All right, I think Ronnie Johnny is pretty much ready for his first day, actually. Let's skip unused time. 
And... I guess we're just like at, in the middle of the night. Skip one this time. No, it's like 7 in the morning. Oh, the bus has arrived. Oh, I see. It's still dark because it's 7 in the morning. Okay, the bus has stopped, but nobody got out. Okay, we're just waiting now for Ronnie Johnny to get to work. His first day of work. Our monthly profits are not very good. And Ronnie Johnny here. Can we manage employees? Okay, we've got Ronnie Johnny. Would you like to begin the... No, we don't need this. Ronnie Johnny is 20. He's part of the core team. He has no salary. Uh, and he can do any job. Okay, fine. Uh, we can educate him. We can... Oh, this is pretty cool. There's a lot of stuff that you can do, actually. Alright, fine. Should we, like, fast forward it a bit? What time does Ronnie Johnny actually turn up? There he is! Finally! 8 o'clock in the morning. Alright, Ronnie. What's the deal? He just came in here, and he's just sitting down having a, having a nap, like, straight away. Alright, we have to develop some software. Uh, would you like to begin the design document tutorial? No way. Okay, fine. What are we gonna call this? We are gonna... Okay, a terminal, keyboard input, and PC speaker. Server, none. Source control management, none. Oh my god, this is like hardcore as hell. Alright, what are we gonna call this? Let's call this... Uh, Ronnie's... Ronnie's big one. <laughs> Alright. Uh, is it gonna be an operating system? No. Let's design a game engine. The game engine is what powers a game. It contains everything needed for a game except for the creativity. Okay, fine. Ronnie's gonna work on a game engine. Alright, why not? Make this product a sequel to another one of your products? No, we want this to be an original IP. Uh, we're gonna make it uh, in-house. No, we're not. We're gonna release a game engine out onto the market and hope that everybody uses it. It's gonna be amazing. Okay, we can't use any source control management. Fine. Operating system? Um, giant Productions? Release date? Uh, the next X? Opticide. Opticide 2. And Opticide 3. Okay, well, these Opticide operating systems have been around for a while, right? And we've got Frame and Frame 2. Super Industries. Alright, look it. Let's make it for Frame 2. And also for Frame as well. Frame 1. Okay. No, let's not. I wonder if we can actually just make this for, like, nothing. License costs. Oh my god. Can we make it for, like, every single one? Or should we just make it for the frame? Frame 2. Okay, fine. Alright, our license costs, are, it's gonna... We can't actually make it for the frame 2. The license costs are too steep. Alright. Specializations. Any? The core team is gonna work on it, yes. Uh, tech space, fine. Use quality assurance to release a more stable product or fix the bugs as your customers irritably stumble into them. Okay, fine. We'll do some Q&A on it as well. ETA is less than a year. We need no artists. Expected interest is like 100%. No innovation. Stability is very high. Usability is very low. OS coverage is 0.00%, uh, which is not very good, actually. Maybe we do need to, like, think about doing some... Let's make it for pen. Okay, let's make it for pen. Oh, look at that. The licensing costs are, like, none. Okay, so now our OS coverage is 2.88%. Okay, so we're going to make an, a game engine for the pen operating system called Ronnie's Big One. And Ronnie is going to start working on, even though the recommended team size is two, Ronnie's going to have to do it by himself. All right. Uh, would you like to begin the design work tutorial? No. Okay. Wow. Holy shit. Okay, Ronnie is... Uh... Uh... <laughs> oh my god. Okay, well... <laughs> Ronnie is working on... <laughs> oh my shit. Okay, so Ronnie's big one is currently underway. It's a small game engine. Ronnie doesn't even seem to be actually typing anything. He is just mashing the keyboard with both of his hands. Like there's no tomorrow and there's a bunch of binary just exploding out of his head. Uh, he is designing it. The expected quality so far is horrible. Uh, do we want to market it? Never. We don't want the marketing tutorial either. Okay, so we have zero budget. Um, let us advertise this on the radio, on TV, no, in newspapers, and let's have a budget of 500 bucks and start a campaign. We're going to pre-market Ronnie's big one in the newspapers for 500 bucks. All right. Cool. We are now marketing Ronnie's big one. Uh, 
we're talking to the press and we've net so far zero dollars. The expected quality of Ronnie's big one is horrible. The core team is uh, assigned to this and is working on it. Change team. No, that's fine. The core team is also responsible for... You think we should hire somebody else? I think we probably should, you know. Never. Okay, we need a new programmer. Specialization in system. Uh, cost. Do we want to spend 500 bucks? Okay, we're going to spend five. You don't have a lot of funds in your insurance account, which will decrease the amount of high quality applicants. Are you sure you want to continue? Yes. All right, here we go. Look at this. All right, let's try to get somebody in around the same age as Ronnie Johnny uh, with similar skills. Okay, so Ellen Osborne here uh, has a score of 6.50%. Salary is 3,117, which is very affordable. Should we interview Ellen? For a hundred bucks? Alright, well, she actually does have some programming experience. Or skill, sorry. Uh, she specializes in code, which is very good. Uh, and her compatibility is um, bad. She is naive and she is mean. Uh, okay. Can we hire her? Yeah, let's do it. You have limited funds to stay in your company if you hire Ellen Osborne. Are you sure you don't want to wait? Are you sure you don't want to wait? Yes, I'm sure I don't want to wait. That's a weird question. All right, Ellen, welcome aboard. All right, I'll tell you what. Now we've got to go back into here. We're going to need to furnish the whole place again. All right, we're going to put Ellen's computer here, I think. All right, we don't need to worry too much about all of this other crap. So we'll turn Ellen's computer around there. And let's give her a crummy chair as well. And she can start work straight away. All right, Ellen, come on in. We need some help. My Ronnie Johnny can't do this by himself, okay? He needs the help of a, another programmer, a crack programmer. Ellen has to turn up for work, hopefully. Can we, like, speed it up a bit? Whoa, look at that. Look at him hammering away on that computer. Holy shit. It's, like, almost 3 in the afternoon. How is he doing? It looks like some progress is being made, but... Okay, he's gone home. Ronnie Johnny goes home at 4 o'clock in the afternoon if you can. Okay, let's skip unused time. Alright. Accept wage negotiations. Uh, okay. Ellen Osborne has requested this much. Accept all and close. Okay, Ellen, fine. Are you sure you want to accept all demands? The, the raises average $6, which is a net change of $6 per month. Yeah, that's fine. We can afford $6 a month to pay Ellen. That's fine. Oh! Okay, they've swapped places now. Now that we got Ellen on board, look at the speed at which Ronnie's big one is being developed. The expected quality is still horrible. It looks like we've made a net profit of minus three dollars from talking to the press, and I guess that's owing to the fact that maybe Ellen and uh, Ronnie, they've gone home again already. All right, we have to, you have minus 1,941 in your account. Do you want to withdraw three dollars from your insurance funds to avoid going bankrupt? Sure. Uh, do you want to take a loan worth 2,000 bucks to avoid going bankrupt? Sure. Uh, do you want to withdraw three bucks? Yeah. All right. <laughs> You're heading for bankruptcy. Oh no. So is every like day a month? Because God, that's going to take forever to develop this. Like that's pretty hard actually. Okay, fine. Are we skipping unused time? All right, we are heading for bankruptcy. Another day. Another dollar, right? Ronnie, Johnny, and Ellen both hammering away the palms of their hands on their keyboards. <laughs> Designing this incredibly terrible... I don't even think this is ever going to see the light of day at this rate. Oh, another day is done. Does that mean that another month has passed and we're going to be in the hole? Or no? It's still April. Alright, do we just want to skip the unused time? Yep, it looks like every day counts for a month. It's May 1980 now. We need to take out another loan. Okay, fine. Yes. Okay, perfect. We're taking out another loan. Uh, we have to finish this product. We're gonna loan ourselves up to the gills uh, and get to the point where we can actually release Ronnie's big one. Hopefully the expected quality will be superb with Ellen on the case here. 
But it looks like basically every month to avoid going uh, into bank uh, into bankruptcy, we're having to take out another loan, which is in itself hilarious. But hopefully with the money that we make from selling Ronnie's big one out there on the market, we'll be able to pay back all of these loans. Should we check our finances? Let's see how... Okay, let's take out another loan, shall we? Uh, let's take a loan for 82,000 big ones. Okay, over the period of 24 months. Okay, fine. So we're going to have to pay back a total of 130,216. The interest is 2.45% monthly, which is about 5,000 bucks. Um, yeah, okay, fine. And let's take this huge loan as well. Great, okay. We should have probably taken a loan to start with uh, instead of taking all those small little loans. Oh. Ellen's fucking gone on vacation already. She's been here for like two months. What the fuck? That is bullshit. Alright, anyway. Ronnie is back by himself. It's July. It's 1980. Ronnie has turned up for another... It looks like this place is getting really gross, actually. Do we have to manage staff? No, I don't want to do this. Okay, we're going to need to hire a cleaning staff. Okay, fine. We've done it. Um... We've hired some cleaning staff, because look, the floor is getting dirty as hell. I think the computers are probably going to be busted soon too, but anyway. Alright, we're skipping the unused time. It looks like the janitor has come in to clean the place. <laughs> and Ronnie and Ellen are actually getting there. Look, at Ronnie's big one is plowing ahead. Designing, the expected quality so far is great. The core team is working on it. It looks like marketing hasn't done too, too well. Uh, we might need to actually get somebody in to do some marketing. Should we do that? Fuck, we're gonna need to. Okay, let's hire some employees. We need a, a marketer. Okay, fine. We're gonna spend 500 big ones on a marketer. And we're gonna see if we can find someone, like, ultra effective. Alright, it looks like Wiley Harper here. Uh, let's interview Wiley Harper, who's a 57-year-old person. Uh, a 57-year-old introvert with a short temper and very bad compatibility. Okay, fine. Maybe not... Well, you know what? Wiley... Wiley is a pretty goddamn good marketer, though. Uh, and the compatibility is very bad. Fuck it. Okay, Wiley, welcome aboard. Alright, before Wiley starts working, uh, we're gonna have to set up another computer. We're gonna have to set up another computer next to... Do we need a phone or anything here? A hollow computer or a wall lamp. That's a coffee machine. Oh, that might be helpful. There's a bookshelf. So we have to like play a small server as well. And we're gonna have to play some of this stuff. Look, there's a fucking toilet, a fridge. Holy shit. There's a lot of shit that you can add. <laughs> this is fucking great. All right, we'll put a chair here and let's get a computer installed for Wiley as well so that Wiley can come in and do some marketing. Wiley will be part of the core team as well. Okay, excellent. Let's skip. Okay, Wiley Harper wants uh, his salary as well, or her salary. I didn't even look at. Uh, is Wiley a man or a woman? He's a man. <laughs> He's looking at his gray ass hair. All right. Wiley should be, hopefully, not coding and instead working on. This room is boring to look at. Why are you fucking fixing up, Wiley? What? You just waiting around for me to do it? Jeez. Okay, so the small game engine is almost done. I can't believe it. Okay, let's skip the... We're heading to bankruptcy, but we'll be fine. Okay, the cleaner has come in and done some cleaning. Wiley is working on the marketing. It looks like the game engine is almost done. The quality is outstanding. Okay, everybody is taking a break now. Why is that? Okay, we're going to assign a core team to marketing now. Okay, perfect. We're running low on money. It looks like everybody is doing the marketing now. So if we get this marketed up, like, really good. Ah, oh, shit. No, we need to assign. We've marketed it. Okay, so the marketing, we probably should have, like, swapped and changed. And... Okay, we have to assign the core team back. It's snowing out now. Holy crap. An employee is hungry and is having trouble working. Well, what the hell? When they go home at night, they should eat, for Christ's sake. We're going to have to skip the night. Ellen Osborne wants a... Fucking pay rise too. 65 bucks per month, my ass. Jeez. Alright, fine. In we go. Alright, forget the marketing. Everybody needs to now work on this. Okay, let's assign the team. We have to start working. Okay, we're gonna have to shove this out the door. We have to release this. Okay, we've... we've. 
uh, where's the, how do you release it? Maybe we should pause the game. Okay, it's ready to go. We're ready to go out into the world with our thing. Data overlay, room labels, no. Market, all software, all companies. How do we do this? Pen, I don't wanna do that. We wanna do a release, upcoming events, no. Your releases, see a list of products you own. Did we finish this one? Project management, support, marketing, design, development. Oh, look at that, it's like all done. End, okay, let's end the marketing. And have we developed it? Do you like to begin the alpha work tutorial? No, okay, I guess we're doing alpha working now. <laughs> oh shit, all right, skip unused time, yes. All right, so the alpha quality is horrible. Okay, so we've done all the design now. Uh, it looks like everybody's got to work on getting the alpha ready. Uh, and then we have to like promote, market, and then a release. Holy crap. Wiley Harper wants to quit. This room is boring to look at. I really have to pee. I am starving. Get out of here, Wiley. <laughs> we don't want complainers on board. Damn it. We're going to have to get another fucking loan. All right. Can we max out the loan? No, we can't. Can we pay back a loan of zero? Oh, we can't. Okay. Wow. We are really up shit's creek with that. Oh, man. Do you want to try to withdraw $6 from your insurance fund? Yes. Will that cover it? Oh, shit. You went bankrupt with minus 13,919 in your account. Quit. Oh, for fuck's sake. Oh, shit. Oh, no. Oh, sips go so soft. Has gone bankrupt. God, oh, what an unforgiving game. <laughs> oh, my God. All right, well, I mean, we were playing, like, balls to the wall there. We wanted to try to... It turns out, actually, that, wow, um, maybe working on a game engine to start with was not the best thing to do um, because it required a lot of money and uh, it required some staffs. So maybe we should have worked on something simpler. Um, we went bankrupt very quickly uh, because we had a lot of costs and we had no income whatsoever. I mean, maybe we should have just set up a server and, like, maybe sort of, I don't know... Um, done like a rental agreement with some people or something like that or i don't know but um there we go i'm gonna have to play this game some more and try to figure it out uh that was the first time i've ever played it i expected completely to fail at it and uh, go bankrupt because i just don't do tutorials and i get really bored reading them and stuff i like to just click on all the buttons and try to figure it out i think um if i play again i'll probably do some things a little bit differently i'll probably try to take on a smaller project uh and now i think i understand all of the different phases you have to go through uh in the project to get it released and uh, maybe start making some money uh, i'll probably go do that next great there you go software inc glad i got it glad i tried it uh it's an early access game so it's still probably needs a lot of work you probably notice there's like no music uh very limited sounds the graphics maybe they'll like update or whatever i mean having said that it is quite funny that the uh dudes just sort of like mash their arms and hands onto the keyboard when they're developing because like i always imagine that that's what people do in real life as well just like yeah i'm just gonna code something bam 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 bam, bam, bam. just like lots of mashing and stuff um it's definitely something that I'll play again uh, and, and try again. Uh, if you'd like me to revisit this at any time, let me know on Reddit or Twitter or in the comments or, or whatever. Um, tell me what you think. I can always come back and maybe do like a series or stream it some or, or whatever. Uh, if not, uh, we'll just leave it there and uh, we'll move on to something else. Great. Well, as usual, thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.